Hello and welcome to Point of View. Today was not a good day for orbital launches in China. A Kuaizhou 1A solid rocket failed after liftoff from the Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center in the Gobi Desert on December 15th, Beijing time. The flight resulted in the loss of a pair of commercial satellites called GSAT 1A and GSAT 1B to test navigation enhancement for autonomous driving. This was the third launch of Kuaizhou 1A since October this year, after the two successful launches on November 25th and October 24th. Here's the footage of Kuaizhou 1A flights in November and October, marking China's 46th and 40th orbital launches of the year respectively both of which were successful missions. The Kuaizhou 1A is operated by XPACE, which belongs to the China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation CASIC, a giant state-owned enterprise with growing space ambitions. The Kuaizhou 1 carrier rocket is the largest solid propellant rocket family in China as opposed to the Long March series that mainly relies on liquid fuel. The 20 meter tall and 1.4 meter in diameter rocket has a liftoff weight of about 30 metric tons. It is capable of sending 250 kilograms of payload into a sun synchronous orbit or 300 kilograms of payload into a low earth orbit. Since its maiden flight in January 2017, the rocket has launched 21 satellites into space. China began to develop the Kuaizhou series in 2009 as a low-cost, quick-response product for the commercial space market. These rockets are built at the 69 square kilometer Wuhan National Space Industry Base in central China's Hubei province. That's all for this video. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you in the next one.